This week's giant to follow is American painter Mary Cassatt. If you like this program, please show your support and click like and subscribe below. Mary Cassatt lived between the years 1844 and 1926. She was born near Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, but lived most of her adult life in France, where she was friend with Edgar Degas and exhibited with the Impressionists. She was born into a wealthy family and studied painting despite her parents' disagreement with it. She moved to Paris when she was 21 years old and took private lessons from several classic artists. Later, she was discovered by Edgar Degas, who made a powerful impression on her. Degas changed Cassatt's life by showing her how to observe nature and invited her to exhibit with the Impressionists. Although Mary Cassatt did not have a distinguished style of her own like Monet, Degas or Renoir, but she took a direction which was very new in the art world. She focused on being a woman, painting like the woman, and painting what was interesting to the women. She was perhaps one of the earliest feminist painters who highlighted societal and political differences that women experience in their life. She developed interesting figure compositions focusing particularly on the portraits of mothers and children. One of her greatest achievement was to show that child care is a liberating practice which gives mothers a role in raising and educating future generations. Although she never got married nor had children of herself, she skillfully conveyed in her paintings the tenderness of the bond between mother and child. Even her brush strokes show the delicate relationship of mother and child. What makes her technique close to the Impressionists is in the use of vibrant color palette and visible brushworks. She paints a different, non-eroticized version of the female body. What stands out in her work is that the subjects don't appear to pose for the viewer. They seem to be focusing on their own activities. To me, Cassatt art is neither a style nor a movement, but has a value system, a revolutionary strategy, and teaches us a way of life. She depicted the new women of the 19th century from the women's perspective. Her artistic portraits of women is done with dignity and suggests a deeper meaningful inner life of women. Her paintings show her attraction to simplicity and clarity of Japanese paintings. In her interpretations, she uses primarily light, delicate pastel colors and does not use black, which was pretty much of a forbidden color among the Impressionists. Mm -hmm. 